Hey, what's up guys? Now, for those of you that have clicked on this video are probably asking the question as to where Expert Games may be and are probably more than concerned about his whereabouts and what he's been up to. And I'm going to try to shed a little bit of light to kind of explain to you guys as to what's going on in his current country of Australia. And before anyone starts putting on their tinfoil hats in coming up with their own conspiracy theories or falsely representing Expert Games to suggest that something may have happened, as of this recording right now, we don't know anything about what's going on with expert games outside of the fact that his country of Australia is on lockdown courtesy of the virus going around in the world. Now, the current restrictions and lockdowns in Australia are really, really bad. And just like many of you guys, I am hoping and willing that this virus goes away and we don't have to deal with this. However, with this new Delta strain going around that's seemingly affecting a lot of people, Australia was one of those countries that was unfortunately dealing with the current effects of what's going on involving said strain. Now, what does this mean for expert games? Well, this could mean one of many things. Perhaps maybe there was a situation where this virus had unfortunately affected one of his family members. We don't even know if said virus had perhaps maybe even affected him. But I have seen many people in the comments section of many videos talk about how perhaps maybe Expert Games is dead, which in my own personal opinion, no, I don't think that Expert Games is dead. Perhaps something may have happened to either him or his family that may have affected him in such a way. At the same time though, we have to be realistic in a sense where Expert Games does doesn't really use social media like that. He doesn't use Instagram. He doesn't use Twitter. He doesn't use Facebook. So there's really no way of knowing, but you have to also understand that this particular unfortunate conclusion isn't off the table to suggest that perhaps maybe there is that chance that perhaps maybe something did happen to him. But by no means is that going to be the number one thing that people should think about because with all things considered involving this virus, with all things considered involving family, it is very unusual to see expert games at least not post once a week, but at the same time, with Australia currently dealing with so much right now, as are the rest of us, I think that in my own opinion, what's going on right now is with Australia basically going under lockdown, Expert Games to me is either simply taking a break or perhaps maybe something did happen involving a close family member or someone very close within his life in which he wants to kind of remove himself from social media from which we all have to understand and respect as people, but at the same time, it's a little difficult when the guy does and use social media, so it kind of keeps us in the dark and asking more questions than how we are getting answers, right? But the one thing that people should not be jumping to conclusions about is the fact that he is dead without any evidence, right? Because there have been many trolls that came online to suggest that he died in a car accident that is false. There are others that said he had died from the virus, which again, we don't know anything about, so that is false. And so I don't think that we should be coming up with our own conclusions until the guy comes back, hopefully he does, and updates us rather than just making a Dragon Ball video as to what had happened because as of this recording, it's been three months, a lot of people have been wondering what's going on. I don't think, like I said before, in my own personal opinion, is this the absolute worst case scenario? Could it be? Is it possible? Yes, but I don't think that's the case. Either he is on vacation or he is going through something else within his personal life because people have to make that distinction to kind of remove the YouTuber from the actual human being that does the video. So for all we know, we don't know what's going on, but I do believe that at some point we will find out once he inevitably comes back. So I just wanted to kind of put that out there to kind of give my two cents as to what I think was going on because it is a little strange not to see anything come from the guy especially when he is used to posting X amount of videos for X amount of time but hopefully nothing majorly bad has happened hopefully he is in good spirits and there's really not much we can do except sit and wait so thank you all so much for listening to this message thank you all so much for listening to this video I greatly appreciate your time and I'll check you guys in the next one